Hello my gorgeous people, is that anyone for me to say it? Yes there is. Hello gorgeous, gorgeous people. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're new here then welcome. I hope you're all good. I'm sweating because it's actually pretty warm. Well it's just one of those days you know where I just can't make up its mind. So I've got a crop top and leggings on and then I've got a actual body warmer. So I am sweltering. Anyway, I hope you're all good. I am having such a lovely start to the week. It's Tuesday. So yesterday was Monday and I went for a Nando's date yesterday, not a date, hey, bloody hell, absolutely fucking not, but with my friend who, you know you've got one of those friends who you've been friends with for years, like we met like later on in life, like in our adult life, maybe like five, six years ago, six years ago I want to say, and it was so weird, last week when I went back to the gym on like my second day, my friend Jo walked in and I was like, what the hell, and we were like, what the hell, um, because obviously I like briefly filled her in over like what was going on, and then while we stood there in the gym, I was just leaving, she was coming in, we literally booked a date in while we were both free, and it happened to be the Monday, that was yesterday, so yeah, we had a little Nando's date, but yeah, one of those friends where you just, it doesn't matter how much time passes between you, like everything's the same, like nothing changes, so now that I'm back in the area and she actually works like in my local area now I was like we have to do something like at least bi-weekly anyway today it's a bit of a crazy day because I'm going glamping we're going on a little staycation my best friend Chloe and I we're literally going half an hour down the road kind of near London now and we are going to a place called Tanner Bryn glamping which I am so excited for they've kindly asked me to go and stay obviously I always share like places in North Wales it's such a popular place for people to come over like summer and for little like cute like UK staycations and there's always places that I like recommend I've been on so many like glamping places obviously in the vlogs before and I do lots of like walks and stuff so yeah I'm always recommending places so I'm super excited that they've invited me because I think it's pretty new but then they've also added like the VIP pods which we are staying in which we are so buzzing about so yeah it's Tanner Bring Glamping just to get that out there I will put all of the details and everything down below and they've got an Instagram account as well and I'm just so excited because I love like checking out like local places and supporting local businesses it's just the best thing so I'm all packed and I'm literally just waiting for Chloe let me show you my little glamping outfit I thought you could all come with us glamping because that's gonna be fun we're gonna obviously we're staying in the pod but we're gonna go and get some snacks and stuff there's a hot tub there we're gonna take some wine oh I need to get some ice in a travel like cold cup thing my mum taught me that best thing one of the best things she's ever taught me is always take ice in like a you know a cold cup what keeps things cold because if there's not ice there then you're always disappointed i've got tea bags obviously as well but yeah we're going there and we're gonna like have a chilled couple of nights but we're also going to do lots of walking i've got the paddle boards in the car in case it's dry and warm enough to go out on the boards tomorrow that would be fun maybe we'll go to like Lynn pad Adam or somewhere i'm not really sure we'll work that out probably not quite paddle boarding in the sea weather but definitely at a Lynn at a lake if you're not welsh and don't know what the hell that means this is my little outfit like I'm actually sweating even though I'm just in like these Effie the Label leggings and this top is another version this is so warm this is like what I literally put over everything in the winter but just in case it is a bit windy like when we're walking I thought I better take it and then I can always just leave it in the car I've got some new balance on but I've got my Crocs if we go boarding and I've also got my walking boots obviously as well but yeah I'm so excited I just thought it'd be a fun little thing to vlog I've washed my hair this morning so it's pretty limp and lifeless for some reason my hair always gets better on like day two is anyone else like that anyway come glamping with us because the next couple of days are going to be so fun honestly is this really necessary for two days of camping two nights um but last night when i was out having dinner we popped into primark and i got me and chloe some matching pajamas look how cute these are obviously they have the love lounge band on them because that's like primark's thing and they're so cozy and soft so i thought that was perfect for like clamping just in case it's a bit nippy later although it'll probably actually be quite hot in the pod i got us both an extra small which is a six to eight and they had so this is the oh no, that's not where's the long sleeve top why do they need the hangers on in primark like honestly i don't want these hangers so this is the long sleeve top which is what i went for because more like loungy chill vibes it's got like these little adjustable ruched bits on the side but they also did the shorts in the trousers so the same but obviously short and then i also got just for myself this little vest top because like when i bring them home obviously after the glamping trip i will probably wear like the long legs and like this little vest top for like getting ready pajamas so they literally had like a few bits in the same fabric like mix and match yeah for me and chloe for our glamping trip i got these matching gin jams how cute and some fluffy socks as well where have they just got over their hair they were a two pack that were matching so i thought that was perfect i'm doing the weekly shop we'll be doing all things we will be doing a shop lots of wine i don't know what my house is they will have won't they look at this i've got pitters i've got anti-pasty i've got some good 
two bottles of wine in the car ready to go straight from the storage unit. Do you know the one? Oh yeah, there they are. Yeah. Is that there? Yeah. What should we get? Like passion fruit, <laughs> mango and passion fruit. What is that? Oh my God, this one. Do you want mango and passion fruit or blackberry and raspberry? Should you get one of each? Two of each? 74 calories per. Um, I'll get the. Yeah, I'll actually get the check. How many calories is this? It doesn't say, so it must be free. Are we rather than the old Instagram? Hi, guys. Hi. Just this. Hi. 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 Hi
home baked bread, Welsh cake, shortbread, jam. What do you call the orange stuff? Marmalade. Marmalade, that's the one. Cow's milk, straight from the farm. I'm just going to try a bit of the shortbread I've just eaten a Welsh cake. Isn't it well? I know, isn't it well? Oh my god, are you kidding? I've got the telly on. I literally bought my laptop thinking I'm going to have to hotspot from my phone for us to watch like a movie or something later. I've got a full on working telly. It's no, not to be a hot tub for I will be a hot tub drinking wine. I don't even need a film. We've just opened the Prosecco and I was literally saying, I'm going to throw a blanket in here. And look, cushions, blankets. We are so buzzing to watch the sunset tonight from the hot tub. We couldn't have picked better weather really, considering how miserable it's been for the last few days. I've actually thought of everything. Like, I can't believe how well thought out everything is. This is so cute. I've just took a little pic of the outside. How gorgeous. I've got my Polaroid with me. Oh, I haven't turned it off. Hang on, hang on. Look how gorgeous this is, visitor guest book. I've just been having a little read of it. I'm going to write something in it at the end of the day. But look, St. Helens. Rutland, they're from St. Helens again, Ackworth, Pontefract, Norwich, the Valleys. Oh, Emily and Emily and Jay from the Valleys. Amazing surprise for my birthday. Nicest place I have stayed in in Wales. The hot tub was definitely the cherry on top. You can tell my mum's on Cardiff because that accent is spot on. Shrewsbury. I fucking love Shrewsbury. Any Shrewsbury people who watch the vlogs. So when I drive from um north wales where i live to south wales where my mother lives she lives just outside of cardiff always stop in shrewsbury at this lovely little um co like local coffee shop i can't remember what it's called what the fuck is it called i can't think of the name maybe when i vlog next time when i'm driving down there i will show you but they literally know me they remember me in there because i've stopped there on my way i always need a wee by the time i get there every time i drive there for literally years sam and grace from stoke on trent Birmingham. Favourite memories of Clanded No. Oh, I feel like if you... Oh, they went to China Garden. What Chinese? Oh, where is else? Oh, everybody's um, recommendations are here. Queen's Head. These went to Conway Castle. Oh, these are all just local places to us. I'm so glad that people like from all over the place come here and experience this. From Kent. And they went to Wealth Mountain Zoo. Birmingham. Runcorn. Going kayaking at Tim Paddad. Oh, that's why we're thinking of going to take the boards tomorrow. Also, guys, listen to this speaking of the boards. So, me and Chloe are just mental and just rarely just communicate very well, clearly. So, Chloe's got her own paddle boards. I've got, obviously, our own paddle boards. And got them out the shed this morning. Like, they're huge. Like, if you've got your own paddle board, you'll know, like, they're not small things to carry around. So, I met Chloe and her mum in Costa Car Park. And when chloe like sort of getting shit out of the car to get into my car she was like oh like where are we gonna put the paddle boards they're massive and i was like i've brought my paddle boards like i she thought she was the one to take hers and i thought i was the one to take mine so we ended up with four paddle boards for the two of us and they're fucking huge anyway back to there and then wiltshire oh they climbed snowden do you know what me and chloe were going to do that i mean obviously we've done it many a times but we were going to do it this weekend but then oh, well, it's not even a weekend this week whilst we were here but then we thought it would take up too much of the day tomorrow and we want to like chill in the hot tub so i think we're going to do the autumn and then we decided we're going to do um sunrise at snowden in a couple of weeks when the weather's like really dry also like the robes are just the cutest things like how handy for that when you get out of the hot tub and it's even a waterfall shower head like the bathroom is gorgeous. It smells like Joe Malone in here and uh, Pomegranate Noir. Also, you can actually bring your own. If anybody's got a caravan camper van, I really, really want to get one. Like, I've made it my thing before I'm 40, which is only a decade away. So, I'm going to get a caravan. So, me and Bumper, a camper van, sorry, one that you drive, not tow. Guys, I thought I'd check out what's going on in the hot drink section. You guys know Yorkshire tea comes everywhere with me. Look at this. should have known are you kidding me are you actually kidding me 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 five stars drip advisor everything 10 out of 10 that that alone okay we're getting in the hot tub the clothes already in jess bays please don't copyright me for this being on in the background Just trying to support the beach you know anyway little mars the label basically naked Got the crap on. We were just admiring Chloe's bikini. Don't know if you can see it from over here. I can't. Show, 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 show the top. How nice is it? It's from, how do you say it? Sheen. 
but the material is unreal. Anyway, we're gonna go and sit in the hot tub, drink wine, and put the world to right. I was like, no. And then I put mine on, and I was like, I was like, I was like, I was Sensational. We're drinking this Castello Diabetha. Of course, the best pale rose in the world. It's unbelievable. The vibes are immaculate. I got a nip slip because I have just got out of the hot tub. No, we're all good. Oh, stunning. So we thought we'll have one bottle tonight. We'll drink Castello Diabetha tonight and have a bottle of whispering tomorrow. Lies. No truth was told, because we're open the whispering now, to be honest. I'm going to lie to you. Oh, I've still got the cork from the freaking... Oh, God, it's all booting off in the House of Commons. Fuck it out. There we go. There we go. Baby bottle of whispering was born. Stunning. Thank you, Tana Bryn, for having a cork opener because that's not something I thought of. Cheers, sexy people. Ugh. Get me a glass. Guys, 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 guys. No, because honestly, oh, my hair got wet. No, I even washed it today. We drank more than we anticipated. What the fuck? I have lost my Mimi sunglasses. We. <laughs> We have no idea where they've gotten to. And other than that, look how gorgeous this sunset is. No, 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 wait, wait. Wait, 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 let's get the focus right. Hang on, bear with me. No, it's not what, hang on, hang on. Oh, there we go. Stunning vibes. North Wales. Why are you so beautiful, please? This is, this is the epitome of North Wales right now because we have the city and the mountains all that close together. And that's why it's a very rare place in the world. Oh, and it's gorgeous. <laughs> She's singing Wrexham FC chants. Ryan Reynolds, we love you. Oh, oh, it's very close. Okay, we're in our matching pajamas. And we've just made our dinner at 10 p.m. at night because you know, we spent all day and night in the hot tub. Just got picky bits on Aldi, as you do, bottle of whispering. These are nice, soft fit around. Yeah. Lovely. But all yum, yum, yum. Feel so good. <laughs> <laughs> we love carbon horrors. That's all about us right last year. I used to Fun fact. I actually used to love Tana Glenn on face. Do you know what I mean? Tana Glenn. Tana Glenn. Tana Glenn. Yeah, yeah, cool. right now. She can't even get the name right. Oh, we worked out how to turn on the neon lights. This is the thing. You can change the colour lot. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, wait, wait! We need a bit of, we need a bit of warm. Right, I think we should go to bed. Got a lot of walking to do tomorrow. Good morning, campers. I've got a tea. Cheers. Chloe's got a instant ready-made sachet coffee, which here she. Oh fuck! Here she is. <laughs> so, guess who had a bit too much wine last night? That was, we fell asleep. <laughs> that was us. Oh my god, honestly. I'm sorry, I've got a headache this morning, but I have got paracetamol with me, and I've got antihistamines as well, just in case any of us was feeling a bit hay fevery. But it's a gorgeous day today, guys. Oh wow, beautiful. It's literally, I was gonna say not cloud in the sky, that's a bit of a lie, but it is gorgeous, gorgeous weather. And I think we're gonna go to Lynn Padan today and go paddleboarding and then 
maybe a long walk when it's like dawn, dusky dawn later. Get ready with me straight from the hat. It's not even a hat, it's a pod. Oh, it's all going on. I'm having three cups of tea, raring to go. Actually, should we have a crumpet before we go? No, I was supposed to bring, I was not supposed to pick up this brow wax, I was supposed to pick up like the jar. Right, that'll do, because to be honest, we're going on a lake. Just wanted to look presentable, you know. You know? You know. My hair is so um, crispy at the ends because it was dipping in the hot tub. <laughs> Lol. My clip kept falling out. My clip's probably at the bottom of the hot tub. Also, you should have seen me trying to get in my wetsuit. <laughs> oh, it's been a while, to say the least, and I don't think it's my current size anymore. Let's put this hair out of the way. Right. I was just going on the phone using Google. Um, your phone's well faster than mine. Fuck knows what we lost what Google. Have you got? Um. 13, that might be the 13 Pro Max. What's the latest one? It's the one before that. That's the eight. I need a new phone. So I need to get a second phone. For oh, that. have you seen how much it is? What? That low lighter. How much is it? Yeah, but actually I left my work on it. Is it on Look Fantastic? You on Look Fantastic? Space NK. Just, um, Chloe's just used my radial banana low lighter which is one of my favourite things to use. Like, it's like, you guys, if you've watched my makeup videos, I always use it. But it's like under eye vibes, but it's like a brightener rather than a concealer. And it's just so good for like no foundation days like we're having today. Um, but it is spenny, but I'm sure my code works on it if you go and look fantastic, you know. You've got, um, yeah, 30 quid. On look fantastic? With your code, yeah. Eight pound off? I think so. That's bloody great. Hey, dates a thin pad on and now we've got to why is my lens greasy there we go um we've got to pump up the paddle boards which i mean we're really not looking forward to but it's not as busy as we thought um also they've done this car park if you've ever been here before it used to be a fucking nightmare but they've actually like done it a little bit so you actually can know where you can park rather than it being carnage um but it's not as busy as we thought so that's a bonus Oh, I wish Meadow was here. There's a little mermaid thing. See it's hard. 15, yeah? Yeah. I like to see the doesn't it? Hello. Hello, this is Jeannie. Hi. Girl. <laughs> Vlog gang, got my phone on the board, risky biz. Here she is. Does anyone else think Chloe looks like Molly Marsh from Love Island? Because I genuinely do. What a gorgeous, gorgeous place. This is one of our favourite um, sub locations, Tin Padan. Lovely, Bala Lake is also beautiful, but it tends to be less busy here to be honest, and there's like more space. Got some lunch. We picked up a sweet and smoky barbecue chicken pasta salad. Source of protein, low in saturated fat. That's the vibe. That was written on by the way. Walking down. Oh. No, look at that dog. Oh my god, look at this dog. I can't. Oh, he's just going to get a stick. Good boy. Oh. <laughs> She's like, drop it then. Oh, he's oh, you know, waiting for it to throw it. I can't. I'm going to cry. Today, I'm going to cry. Guys, guys, look. No, stop. Oh, he can't find it. Oh, no, you are everything. No, his ears, his happy ears. Oh, he's got it, look. Oh my God, no. A dog's not the best thing in the book. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
With your hand. <laughs> 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 Take a leg each. <laughs> Honestly, I don't oh know why God. I'm stuck so much. Oh can't breathe. <laughs> Right, basically, oh my God. it's stuck on the ankle. Give me the other one. Give me. <laughs> oh no, I'm dead. Oh, oh thank fuck for that. Oh, wow. No, I thought I was just sunglasses. We feel fully like we're on our holidays because Slandered know it's full of holiday makers. So we've been back to the pod after paddle boarding. We got some supplies, we got pizzas for this evening. We got some more wine because we drank it all last night. And then we thought we'd drive to the Great Orm um, to get our steps in before we actually eat. So let me just show you where we've pulled up. We're gonna literally do the full, the full shebang. Oh, hang on, there's a car coming. Thank you. Can you believe this is on our doorstep? Like, how the hell did we get so lucky? Oh, one another car. I wish these cars would realise it's one way and that you don't actually have to drive on the left side of the road because honestly, it's not okay. Anyway, I'm gonna leave my camera in the car. Um, you can literally drive around the whole thing, but we're gonna walk around it. I'm gonna leave my camera in the car just because it's annoying to carry, but if I get any nice clips, then I'll get them on my phone. But how beautiful. Wave cloud to the vlog gang. Hello, vlog gang. Hello. When you walk around uh, the little cove around the other side, there's always like baby seals just having a little rest on like the rocks. It's so cute. Just on a little pit stop on the way out of here. Let's go to this viewpoint, Claire. Look at this, guys. Unbelievable scenes, if you ask me, Chloe McKenna. Unbelievable. Doesn't get much better than this, let me tell you. Something special, this part of our world. And we are back. <laughs> We're finishing the whispering before we open another one. We've got the sunset just happening and we've just lit the pizza oven, which we're excited for. These are the ones that we went for in Tesco. We've got so, oh, can't even fucking say that. hot honey wood fired pizza and we've got chicken with lime and mint, which they both look insane. So that's what we're having for our dinner this evening in our pizza oven. Oh, that's just beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. Wow. Oh my days. <gasps> that is something special. Yeah. Thank you, Tesco's finest. This is us for the night, darlings. It's quarter to ten. Got the pizza, now we're on the wine. And we've watched the sunset. Couldn't that be more perfect? Darlings, hello. Guess who edited the vlog last night and then realised they didn't even round up the vlog? classic me um i've just got back from the gym so i'm a bit of a sweaty mess but just wanted to come and say hello and goodbye from the glamping vlog basically honestly we had such a good time <laughs> it was so good i'm actually going to put it on text at the start of this video but town bring glamping are very kindly given me hang on let me just see what the code is if you use code asher 10 in capital letters this will give you a discount on bookings from October the 1st until February the 28th next year. So that's very nice of them. Yeah, I actually asked for that code because I just said to them, I think people will actually want to book after they see the vlog and like where we've been on my Instagram story. And it's always nice for people to be able to get a little bit of discount on something like that. So yeah, I'll put a link and all of the details about my code and everything down below too. Have to say it, but it's not an ad, but I was kindly invited to stay there, like I said at the start of the video. But yeah, it's just so nice to be able to share things in my local area, support local businesses, family run things. And honestly, if you've never been to North Wales before, and you and your best friend, or you and your boyfriend, or you and whoever fancy a little UK staycation with some water sports, gorgeous walks, we invite you to North Wales. Just make sure you pick up your rubbish. Anyway, I'm gonna round up the vlog.
I'm gonna, oh my God, your eyes are so mucky. You've just woken up. I also just wanna say, um, after last week's vlog, oh no, not last week's vlog, sorry, the week before that, we missed a week of vlogs last week. My apologies. Basically, you guys don't really notice this, but I film like a week in hand. So generally when I'm in my routine, I film and edit a week in hand. Obviously my life's been a bit crazy over the last few weeks with like moving back to Wales and just everything being all over the place. So I've been filming and editing in real time and it's quite hard for me to do that sometimes because if I've got like a busy week and I don't have time to edit, then everything's just rushed and I prefer giving myself like a week to do it, if that makes sense. So skipped a week last week. So I could give myself time to get back to being a week in hand if that makes sense you guys like i said probably won't even notice but it's just how like my schedule works in my brain but yeah after the vlog that went live last time i had so many there's so many lovely comments on that i had so many lovely messages and i just want to say so many of you are messaging me asking for advice asking me to talk about general life things a bit more and something is going on behind the scenes there's something a little project or it's not little but a project that i'm working on with another influencer a very good friend of mine and it's something that will give us a platform and allow us to talk 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 a lot about this kind of thing general life stuff and just life experience and it's gonna be so cool it's so exciting and so fun but yeah we will talk about that in a couple of months maybe now yeah just wanted to say um a huge thank you because the comments are so lovely i need to sit and reply to them all actually because i just haven't had a minute i've been here there and everywhere which you will see in next week's vlog so many of you say like you take so much like little bits of advice from me and just like little pointers and little tips and you know little bits of gratitude just for general life and honestly that's all I'm here for just here to put a little positive spin on things and give a better outlook and I think people who change the way you think about things or change the way you look at things are so important in the world anyway I definitely need a cup of tea after that gym session and I hope you all enjoyed the glamping vlog it was so fun it's nice to do something a little bit different I'm gonna go stick the kettle on and I will see you all in next week's vlog